What's up, what's up, what's up? This is your main man from the Forex Strategy Factory, aka Forex Wizard 666. This is 2020, man. You know, I've come here to show you two things today in my first video in 2020. Do you know what I mean? <coughs> oh my god, sorry, sorry. That's a cough, that's a sudden one, man. You know, I'm here to show you, show you something, okay? Gonna build a good chart for you. And I'm going to analyze the market for you and give you exactly where this market is going. So you will know how to do this by yourself. You know, one more time Forex Strategy Factory, aka Forex Wizard 666, doing exactly what I love, doing what I do every time. This channel is about strategy. Whatever strategy you need, check it out here, man. And someone said to me, I have not seen your face, man. I have not seen your face, man. Why we cannot see your face? okay and this is why there's a camera on my screen right now for you to see me properly and now i'm gonna remove my glasses so you'll see my face and i'll continue to do what i do hey <laughs> hey this is your boy man this is your boy man i say thank you to my fans okay all those fans who love my content love my video and love everything i do i used to say you want to see my face hey this is me I say thank you so much for that because I know you gave me love and that's why I keep doing what I do. You know what I mean? All right. Love you too, guys. So now let us go. Now look at my screen. I'm going to remove this grid. Grid. I'm going to remove grid. We don't need this grid. Come on. Wait. I've got something I have to do right here. Boom. Sorry. Remove the grid from the screen. This is how I do start my strategy. Boom. Now I want to show you something. I want you to pay attention. Whatever you see on this chart by this shape, this is telling you that this market is going up. Where do we start looking at it? Look at something. I want to show you something. This makes a high. Boom. Came back. Okay. What is the expectation? When it has created high and come back, Definitely, we expected it to go back to break that high. Okay. Boom. Went by. Couldn't get to the high. Boom. Came back. All right. No problem. But we expected to come break this high that was created. This is the current high of this season. People bought. It's gone and rally to break the high and created a new high. <laughs> Keep watching. After creating a new high, after creating this high, it dropped. Boom. Season low. All right. It's created a new high, man. Breaking this previous high. Creating new high. After creating that. Boom. Season low. The season. The low of the season. After the low of the season, what do you expect? After the low of the season, the price will go and break the previous high that was created this is the high that was created the price will come break this high that is created okay wait wait something i'm gonna do for you right now i want you to see how i'm gonna build this chart but i'll analyze it now on the negative on the on the on the on the naked perspective of the chart all right but let us build the chart Okay, we want to build the chart. Now, let me show you something we're going to use. Let me show you something we're going to use. All right? Now, we want to go grab a template. No, you don't need a template, okay? You don't need a template, okay? You don't need a template. But we want to go grab a template, okay? You can do candlestick, okay? Candlestick is still okay. But I just want to go grab one template, okay? I want to grab a template. We don't need template. But I just want to grab a template. Now, this is my template. Kijun Fluxion Template. That's my template. Kijun is all over internet. It's free. Now, this is the way it looks. Kijun Template. This is what it looks like, and I love it. I love it so much. But what I'm going to do now, okay, 
I want you guys to pay attention to this video. It's gonna it's gonna be a video of maybe four or five parts, okay? Because you know we're building a chart here. Now let's zoom it properly, okay? Because this is how we can see the market properly. When we zoom it, okay, if we don't zoom it, we don't know what the market has done so far. So we're gonna zoom, okay? This is it now. This is exactly it looks on the naked one. If you remember how it looks on the naked chart, this is what we're looking at. Okay, now look at something. It's created something look like a M, M shape. Okay, took it off. Now from here, from this low of this week to this point one, two, it's created M shape. This is a big M shape. This M shape are called Gatling, but now what is going to happen? This will go up, but that is not what we're doing now. Let us build the chart. Then we will um, we will then analyze the market properly. Let us build the chart first. Now we're going to put the kind of um, let's say we want to put something like um, we're going to go step by step, support or resistance, okay support resistance support resistance is very important very important in the market on your chart but i've seen a lot of people they confused about it they don't use it i don't know why but let me find it support resistance so give me a few minutes to find it because we need it, I'm gonna find it. Support resistance. Okay, I found it. Let it load there. I'm gonna use this support resistance of a period of 500. Do you know why? I will tell you why. It's gonna alert me everything, but I will tell you why. It's 500. Okay, because you see, the 500 support resistance, okay, it helps you to capture the the high and the low of the week of the current week or the previous week whichever it is it will be helping you to capture it okay now look at based on this support resistance that we're looking at right here all right this price have started from this support got to resistance and bounced back down after breaking this current high and create a new high it bounced back down and the way look at it this is going to be you know this was the support this will be the next support can you see some some squeeze some squeeze around here if you can see some squeeze around here that shows you it's where the market has turned around it it is the is the support so this squeeze is going to be the next support this support will come back here okay and that's why price is playing around it price is playing around it it's playing around support so what do you want to do around support if the price is going up you know you want to buy you know it's time to buy around support <laughs> you know that right it's time to buy around support it's the low the low of the week this is why we use the support resistance 500. The low of the week, you will get. This is the low of the week. This is the low of this week. This support will come here now. By next week, it starts here. And this continues to go up. This is the high was created this week. And this high will be broken to create a new high. Which is going to lead to the creation of a new resistance. Which means it might break this high. Good. Do you see how we think in the forex market? This is how we think in the forex market, man. <laughs> this is how the big boys, the big players who see the big picture of the market, this is how they follow it. But there are different ways to trade the market, though. But let me tell you something now. It's going to break here. But we want to play it in a way that because we know what it's going to do is going to break this high to create a new high 
and we know it's going to break this high so we want to get out from here while it was to why it will be doing all those things we want to get out from here all right don't worry take it easy we're moving on <laughs> support resistance 500 you will get it on the link under this video i will put the link under this video you will get it there you understand me nothing to worry about just keep looking how we're gonna build this chart okay all right man let me see if my video is still recording because sometimes this my software do play some shit on me i just want to see it am i still recording or am i just talking no so sorry for that break in transmission you know i just went to check if i'm still recording or maybe i'm just talking to the camera you know it's happened to me a lot of times so back to the support resistance talk we we'll finish with that all right now the the way i'm going to analyze this to you is to explain to you about support resistance okay if you are new in the forex and you 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 are not good with these things that i've mentioned here about the shape i know it's beyond your knowledge this is why i told a lot of you guys that it's better you go to school go learn forex there's a link under this video that talks about the forex university if you click that button you go there they will teach you everything you need to know about forex and you will be given a good strategy to use okay we share signal we know we share signal but you know when you got the knowledge of forex all these things will never be new to you you know what i'm saying all this ghastly shape a lot of people cannot spot it out with their naked eyes yes if nobody ever told you you cannot find it out this is ghastly okay now this is the formation of ghastly started from here create a high came back yes then what's it gonna do again yes if gatley came back then gatley will raise his head again and go up to break the previous high this is the high broke on it previous high broken gatley is gonna go back down down then what's gonna happen again this is a previous high gatley will come break the previous high man boom broken gone this is a high then look at the size of the gatley how it right exactly the same size it went back down boom the size of the gatley and this is why after gatley came back down what is going to happen it came back down to create a support gatley is now expected to rise up and go break the high it's created this is one high right here gatley will come and break this high here yes and it will create a new high somewhere we got our take profit right here we know it's going to create a new high around here before it will ever break this high it's going to break this high in the long run maybe in the month or in the week it will break this high but we know currently it will break this high to create a new high somewhere around here this is why we have our tp target around here You know the reason why i did not continue with this video like okay let me rush you let me rush it let me put the next indicator is because i want you to follow me step by step i don't want to rush okay i put support resistance 500 now i have explained about support resistance 500 and i told you guys that for you to have the knowledge of forex go to school click on the link below this video you see forex university Go there, they will teach you all you need to know. All this godly shape, cipher, all this uh, market, um, um, what, we, what we call them, pattern, is not going to be new to you anymore. Once you know them, your eyes will be able to spot them out when you see them and you know what they're doing. You understand? Okay? Good. We will continue. So, the next thing we need to go and put on this video Mm? it's a bollinger band okay 
And let's say we're going to go put a Bollinger Band of it.